My name is Aaron Reeland. I'm an owner and brewer at Bad Habit Brewing. I uh, started brewing in 2001. On a whim, bought a home brewing kit with uh, my good buddy Ryan. Didn't follow the instructions real great the first time. We uh, slapped the beer together out of a kit from Baker's Hobby in St. Cloud. And didn't let it ferment long enough and bottled it. And uh, later that night, about two in the morning, we had uh, exploding bottles in the basement, glass shards and the sheetrock in the ceiling. And we drank a few of them a couple weeks later. It was all right. Thought it was a stupid hobby, packed the stuff away. A few years down the road, I found the kit and decided to give it a try again. Shared some bottles with uh, friends and family who you know, are also craft beer drinkers. People started saying, hey, this isn't half bad. We started brewing our own recipes and experimenting with that stuff. And we started coming up with some names. When we picked Bad Habit, we, you know, we thought that that was a good name for the brewery because my uh, wife and my kids were giving me a hard time about all the brewing we were doing and turning into a bad habit. So we, we started looking for a location and we really, really fell in love with the, the area in St. Joe. Just the community was great. When we got to St. Joe, we knew that this was a place we wanted to call our home. Just the support of everybody in this town. Now, a big part of us uh, coming to St. Joe when we got here was the food options on Main Street. We want to make good beer and partner it with good restaurants in St. Joe. You know, we've talked to a few of the places, Kay's Kitchen and the local blend coffee shop and Bella Cucino and, and Sliced on College Avenue, which is a new pizza place opening, which we're very excited to have them here. And you know, there's, those are good hometown, small town businesses that we want to be partnered with. Some of the things we'd like to do with the, the money raised with the Kickstarter campaign is uh, We'd like to do an all glass overhead door to the outside. Uh, so in you know, spring and fall, we can open that up to a, a really neat patio that'll seat 30 to 40 extra people. Number two, we, we'd like to order another fermenter and another bright tank so we can, we can bring some more beer to the community here and be able to produce more and keep more on hand. And then lastly is uh, we'd like to use some of that, those funds towards uh, buying the rest of the furniture and that being the chairs and the stools so we can get the good, comfortable stuff for people to sit on when they come in. We want families to come in and order pizza or order food and enjoy a pint or two and let the kids share in the experience with mom and dad. My family being behind me and my friends, the time and effort that everybody's put into this is, is something that means more to me than anything in this world. At Bad Habit Brewing, we want to give an experience that can be shared with the whole family.